Hi everybody, I'm back again with some more collage, of course. Just can't get enough. I think if I could collage every day, I'd be quite happy. Although I do like painting too, so maybe have to switch it up every now and then. Anyway, I'm playing in my Large Dilusions Classic Journal. And I'm just, I had that bottom of the face left over from, I had used the eyes in that landscape one. So I thought I would use up that one. So I needed to find some eyes and those popped pretty well. I really didn't know what I wanted from this page. <laughs> I kind of had the idea first of like just having a bunch of flowers, but that didn't happen. But I do want to do that at some point. So another day, another collage, and another video for you. So I'm sorry it's a voiceover again, but lately I've just been wanting to be quiet and listen to music or watch something on Netflix while I'm collaging. And I have to mute it when I do that because, you know, copyright and all that stuff. So you have to put up with a voiceover from me. So I found this piece and it's not flowers. Well, it's, it's like flower petals. But they're just so light. Like, if flowers, if flower petals could be made out of jellyfish, <laughs> that's the kind of look it has to me. Like that see through <laughs> look. If you could combine them, I feel like that's what it would be. <laughs> anyway. So that is what I ended up going with and honestly this page came together pretty quick I mean this is a video from me Denise Lush that is less than 30 minutes like that's unheard of and I know it took me longer than 30 minutes but even still I can rarely edit videos down to less than 30 minutes. Very rare. So that tells you how quick and easy this layout was. And it was very simple. So simple. <laughs> like I really didn't do a whole lot. I'm going to have to find something to play with. Like I miss... Like, I love the simple collages, too. There's just something about them that I find so striking and beautiful. Like, I don't know. There's just something in the simplicity that I really like. But, with that being said, I really like that page I did with the castle and the queen. You know, that freebie she had with the queen. And then I did a two-page spread in this journal. I really like that as well. So I do like having some more elaborate pages. But I think when I did this one, I hadn't done anything like all weekend. We had a long weekend and I didn't get to art at all. So I had to do something. So I think I actually put this together late at night and then the next day I glued it down and added the pen, like marker, whatever. So yeah, really quick. I get grouchy if I, I don't know, well, sometimes I get grouchy, but it's not even so much that, I just feel off like something doesn't feel right if I go too long without arting 
I mean, I'm used to doing it every day. So having to go like three days without it. The only time I usually go a long period of time without doing something is when I go to Newfoundland to visit my family. And even then, I have been bringing like a little sketchbook and some watercolor sometimes. Like the last time I went to Newfoundland, um, I, my sister-in-law and I sat down to her kitchen table and did some watercolor. And I did some artwork for her, like really simple stuff. Like I really wanted to ask her if I could like just do it over <laughs> or do it when I came back home and do it properly because I didn't have really nice paper or anything. I just had cheap crap from Walmart or somewhere. Like, there was no art store where I was, so I just had cheap paper. But anyway, yeah, so sometimes I make others art with me too. <laughs> but we had a good time and she enjoyed it. And I bet you she hasn't done it since, but she was like, I need to do this. I need to get into this. <laughs> but she has two little ones, so she doesn't have as much free time as I do. So that is it for the collage bits and all I did after that is this like paint pen just going in with some lines. A part of me kind of wanted to doodle like in all the empty craft space or at least do a little more than I did but I liked what I did in the end. And I was afraid if I went further with it that it was going to be too much. Because like I said, some things are just really nice left simple. So I was happy with, it, with what I did. So I thought, why chance it? Now it would be different if I didn't like it. Then I wouldn't, you know, there's no harm in going further. Because if you already don't like it, oh well. I just loosely traced it and then it all started <laughs> like on the very first leaf I did or flower petal whatever it is I went over the actual petal by mistake so then I just continued to do it on purpose like not throughout the whole thing but just every now and then I would do it so then it looked intentional and then I just ended up doing more of these lines. Which I don't know if I'm glad I did or not. Like, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. And I do think adding the black around the petals made everything stand out. Like before it was just all a bit bland. But this is what I was picturing after. Like just these wiggly lines outside of it and all throughout so I thought of doing that and like filling out the craft spot but like I said I was a little nervous that it would be too much I do love those black lines on the craft. Even just those little squiggly lines, I think it added a lot. And then I just went in with the white and filled in parts here and there. I think I was going to go back in with the black again after to bring back some of the lines that got um, marked over with the white accidentally. I don't think I ever did. I think I totally forgot to do that. So 
oh well it's done and here's the video so it's not gonna get done now so that is it that is all I did for this page so you know you don't have to go elaborate and spend days on a collage page it can be quite simple and still beautiful I mean the collage images do a lot they are so striking that little work is needed on your part like they are just beautiful so thanks so much for watching the video I do hope you enjoyed it don't forget to give me a thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribe to my youtube channel and since it's not guaranteed that my videos will show up in your feed and if you don't want to miss out hit the bell notification and that way you will be alerted when I put out a video have a great weekend bye